have you been priced out of the sarasota bradenton real estate market if your answer is yes you are not alone a lot of people are in your shoes in this video i will take you to a community where you can find a great home at a great price and still be within driving distance to sarasota stay tuned it will be fun hello and welcome i'm millicent shandoff latte welcoming you again to another episode of thriving in greater sarasota the sarasota real estate market has become quite expensive and a lot of people are being priced out in this video i will show you a place where you can buy a great home for much much less than the sarasota area and still be able to enjoy sarasota we are going on a tour of a community called mangrove manor in the city of apollo beach I will tell you a bit about the city of Apollo Beach and also introduce you to a couple of other cities in the, in the general vicinity. Why? Because those cities are close enough to Sarasota, but their home prices are much lower. So you can live there and enjoy the beaches of Sarasota as much as you want to. Oh, and we will tour one of their furnished models before we are done. Don't go anywhere. Watch till the end. It will be fun. I introduce you to Mangrove Manor in Apollo Beach. And with that, say hello to the cities of Ruskin, Riverview, Waimama, and Sun City Center, all in the southern part of Hillsborough County. We will get to these cities later, but now let's talk about Mangrove Manor. Mangrove Manor is a brand new community of single family homes nestled in a quiet neighborhood in Apollo Beach. The community is right off US 41 and right next door to the Mira Bay Village Shopping Plaza complete with your own grocery store, restaurants, and all the shops you need to make your life a little easier. What does this community offer? It will be a relatively small community. There will be 215 single family homes ranging in size from 2,000 square feet to over 3,300 square feet. It is a gated community and it is also a CDD community. So there will be CDD fees to pay in addition to your HOA and taxes. But there's no need to be apprehensive. The fees are not too bad. Both HOA and CDD fees will total you just a little less than $2,000 per year, which amount to about $166 per month. And if you don't know what CDD fees are, please educate yourself by watching two videos that I made on the subject. As far as amenities, a community pool with an open air cabana are the only amenities provided. But the lots are large enough for you to have your own pool in your backyard. The schools are Apollo Beach Elementary, Eisenhower Middle, and Leonard High Schools. You can go to the Hillsborough County website or greatschools.com or niche.com for more information about the schools. At this time, the base prices without the lot premium are from the low to the high 400,000s, depending on the model. And the lot premiums are from $5,000 to $70,000, depending on the size and location. If it's on a large corner lot with a lake view, then you can expect to pay more. But even then, when you add the lot premiums and all the upgrades to the cost of the house, you could be well below $600,000. In Sarasota, similar homes could cost you anywhere from the high 800 to a million dollars, seriously. And the good thing is, if you get in now, you can get those good prices before they begin to go up and the prices will go up. You better be sure of that. I am excited about this community because it offers an opportunity for people who have been priced out of the Sarasota Bradenton market to get a good value on a home and still be relatively close to the Sarasota area. If you are intrigued and want more information about this community, please call, text, or email me. My information is in the description box below. And this is why I pause to say that if you are enjoying this video, please hit the like button subscribe to my channel and write a comment about what you think about this information and share the video with your friends. Let me tell you a little bit about the city called Apollo Beach. It is a small town right on the waters of the Tampa Bay. Even though the name has the word beach, it is not your regular ocean beach like Siesta Key or Bridgerton Beach. They do have a public park, an aquatic park called the Apollo Beach Nature Reserve. It is a beautiful park where you can visit and enjoy nature, go on a walk, take in the view of the gorgeous Tampa Bay and catch an incredible sunset. On a lucky day, you might even see a manatee or two in the water. However, there is no swimming allowed in the waters. Needless to say, Apollo Beach is a town on the bay and there is plenty of water for you to play with. 
fish, ride a boat, or have a waterfront property. And everything that living on the water has to offer. If you are thinking about moving to the Sarasota area to soak up the sun, enjoy our wonderful beaches and lifestyle, but you find that the Sarasota Bradenton market has become too pricey for you, I would invite you to give this community and this city a chance. It is right in the middle, in the right midway between Tampa and the Sarasota Bradenton area. You are 38 miles to Lido Key Beach, 33 miles to Bradenton Beach, and 48 miles to Siesta Key Beach. You can still enjoy a good Florida lifestyle in a beautiful community in a lovely city and still have access to the beaches of Sarasota, Bradenton. Now let's go back to the other cities south of Hillsborough County. Hillsborough County is north of Sarasota and Manatee and is the county of Tampa. Let me show you on the map. And this is Apollo Beach. This is Science City Center. Here you have Riverview. This is Rusking. And um, this is Waimama which is east of Sun City Center. As you can see, they are all on the I-75 corridor and all within less than one hour's drive to the sandy beaches of Sarasota and Bradenton. With the traffic, it, it could take you anywhere between 40 minutes to one hour or more. But if you've lived in a big city, then you know real traffic. A little traffic here on the I-75 will not be anything you haven't seen before. And you are saving hundreds of thousands of dollars on your home. Think about that. It is worth thinking about. If there are any more deals to be had in this crazy real estate market, this is where to find them. The added advantage of living here is its proximity to Tampa. You have all the advantages of living close to a big city like employment opportunities. If you want to explore this community and others like it, reach out to me and let's talk. I will make all the arrangements and take you around. And I will be there with you throughout the transaction, making sure everything is done properly. My contact information will be in the description box below. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to my channel, and as always, I ask you to share the video with your friends and family who can use the information. Now let's go do the furnished model tour I promised. This is the Lantana model. It is 2,045 square feet, four bedrooms, two and a half baths, and a two car garage. I hope you enjoyed our tour. Thank you for watching. Until my next video, I will see you soon.